Greetings to everybody. My name is Christoph Fenveshi, and I'm very happy to welcome you at the Steambox course. I'm working in the Finnish Institute for Educational Research at the University of Juvascula, and I'm very happy to share with you a good practice, one example for a STEAM project, and it was called the sound of music. This project uh, has been realized in one of the local schools uh, not too far uh, from here and I was very happy to work together with the students and the fantastic group of teachers uh, in this project. I will uh, recommend you to check out uh, this uh, video uh, which uh, provides you an audiovisual uh, 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 summary of the project results and, and all, all the steps in the project. I think uh, that will uh, provide you the best uh, insight of all what has happened in the project. Maybe it's worth to even stop uh, this video, what you are watching now, and look uh, for this link uh, including your materials and then uh, watch uh, the project uh, itself, the STEAM project itself, and then return uh, to my lecture where I explain the background uh, of this whole uh, project. So there were five teachers uh, included uh, in this project. We had uh, Mirka, Ulla, Maria, Maria and uh, Vescu, and you can see how many subjects has been represented. So mathematics, arts, physics, chemistry, music, uh, Finnish language, and uh, even handicrafts. Uh, handicrafts played actually one of the key roles uh, in, this, in this project. And we managed to involve 120 students. So that was a a complete grade uh, in this uh, school. So all uh, students in the same grade in the different classes has been involved in this project. You can see in this uh, picture uh, Mirka uh, on the uh, right side. Uh, she's the maths and art uh, teacher. And uh, here is uh, Vesku on the, on the left, is the crafts uh, teacher. There was uh, also uh, uh, included uh, a teacher training uh, event, a professional development course uh, for the participating teachers. And uh, it was also combined uh, with the multidisciplinary learning events in the school. And this was provided uh, for the students. And we even involved an external uh, expert uh, into the course that was Juan Ignacio Mendoza Garay, a musicologist, uh, one of my colleagues uh, in the University of Hubascula. The program started with an opening where we uh, discussed and uh, drawn up uh, the different goals. And then the teachers of the various subjects were greeting the students and briefly introduced this two days project two days program or the workshops. So uh, the workshops uh, included uh, the creating the musical instruments. You can see uh, some photos in the background and you can also see uh, some snapshots of uh, how the uh, project uh, progressed. So first uh, we created as a, as a manufacturer uh, these instruments, but then uh, there were different uh, notations uh, developed uh, and also the musical instruments being uh, played and uh, musical compositions uh, has born uh, with these instruments. And there were also uh, technology involved. So the students recorded the sounds of the instruments, what they made, they studied uh, the 
frequency uh, uh, dimensions of uh, sound, the physical properties of sound, they uh, created uh, various effects with the help of uh, technology. And uh, then uh, there were uh, also uh, a musicology perspective added uh, to all these operations and the transformation, the musical transformation of uh, sound. And also uh, there were uh, various physical physics experiments uh, made uh, with the sound and also digital composition techniques has been uh, also uh, taught uh, to the to the to the uh, children to the participants so in the workshops uh, there was also opportunity to uh, discover uh, musical patterns and uh, the develop uh, own notation uh, system and uh, students even made uh, little performances uh, to each other and they experimented with rhythmic patterns and uh, created final uh, compositions uh, what they have learned and there was also uh, the great opportunity for the music teacher uh, to facilitate uh, this process. So I really hope uh, that you uh, enjoyed uh, the video about uh, the, the project itself. And also I hope that uh, my explanations help a bit uh, to understand uh, what has happened in this project. Thank you so much uh, for your attention. Thank you.